Aloha! My name is Kylie Matos and today I'll be showing you how to make a haku style tea leaf lei. The haku style blade making is done by braiding flowers and foliage into a base to build a lei. First we begin by picking our leaves. For a lei po'o you will need about 20 to 25 leaves and for a lei a'i about 25 to 30 depending on how long you want it. Start by cutting the leaves off the bone. This will give you two halves of each leaf. Set aside about 12 halves to use for the base of the braid. With the remaining halves, you're going to cut them diagonally into long diamond points. You want them to be about 5 inches long and not too wide. For the halves set aside to braid, you're going to want to soften them up. This can be done by freezing them overnight, ironing them, or putting them in boiling water for a few minutes. To start the lay, you're going to take three of the long pieces and tie them in a knot. Try to get the knot as tight and close to the end as possible. You can have someone hold the knot for you or use your toes to keep the lay in place while you braid. Start braiding the leaves until you've gone about three to four inches down, making sure to twist each leaf as you braid to get as tight as possible. This is going to be one of your ties to secure your finished lay. Now we're going to start adding our points. Take a diamond shaped leaf and pinch the sides together in the middle. You're going to want to make sure that the shiny part is facing out. Place two points onto the braid and use the outer piece to wrap and secure them. Flip the bottom ends of the diamonds up and tighten. Add another two points and braid them in, flipping the bottoms up and securing them. Make sure you're twisting the braid strands and keeping everything tight. Keep repeating the step and braiding the points in. To add more length, you're going to take one of the long soft leaves and place it over the leaf you are extending. Twist the new leaf and the remainder of the old leaf together, add two points, wrap the braid, and flip the bottoms up before securing. Continue adding the diamond points until you've reached your desired length. Once you've added all your points, braid another 3-4 to four inches for the tie. Knot it off and trim the ends. Go through the lay and spread out all the points to add fullness. And there you have it, a beautiful haku style tea leaf lei that can be worn as a lei po'o, a lei a'i, or as kupe'ez.